Moscow is the capital, and the largest city in Russia. In this video, we are going to show you, the evolution of Moscow, from its early civilization, up to the modern city of today. But before anything else, please consider subscribing for more interesting videos. As early as 1147, Moscow became a minor town on the western border of Vladimir Suzdal Principality. In 1156, Nyes Yuri Dolgoroki, fortified the town with a timber fence and a moat. In the course of the Mongol invasion, the Mongols under Batukan burned the city to the ground, and take control of the place. In 1380, Prince Dmitry Donskoy of Moscow, led a united Russian army to an important victory over the Mongols in the Battle of Kulikovo. Afterwards, Moscow took the leading role in liberating Russia from Mongol domination. In 14th century, the original Moscow Kremlin was built. It was reconstructed in 1480, by the architects from Renaissance Italy, who designed the new Kremlin wall and its towers. In 1500, Moscow population reached 100,000, and became one of the largest cities in the world. In 1592, a total of 50 towers, was erected around the city, including an area on the right bank of the Moscow River, as a defense against the Crimean Tatars' attack. In the 16th and 17th centuries, the three circular defenses were built, the Katagorod, the White City, and the Earthen City. During the first half of the 17th century, the population of Moscow doubled from roughly 100,000 to 200,000. By 1700, the building of cobbled roads had begun in the city. In 1730, the permanent street light was introduced in the city. In 1741, Moscow was surrounded by a 40-kilometer-long barricade wall. The Kamerkalisky barrier, with 16 gates at which customs tolls were collected. In 1812, when Napoleon invaded Russia, Napoleon's Grand Army was forced to retreat and was nearly annihilated by the devastating Russian winter and sporadic attacks by Russian military forces. As many as 400,000 of Napoleon's soldiers died during this time. In 1917, following the success of the Russian Revolution, Vladimir Lenin, moved the capital from Petrograd to Moscow in 1918. The Kremlin once again became the seat of power and the political center of the new state. During World War II, the Soviet State Committee of Defense and the General Staff of the Red Army were stationed in Moscow. During the attack of the German Army Group, they were stopped at the outskirts of the city and then driven off in the course of the Battle of Moscow. And the city was declared to be in a state of siege. During the post-war years, there was a serious housing crisis, solved by the invention of high-rise apartments, using prefabricated apartment blocks housing the majority of Moscow's population. In 1980, Moscow hosted the Summer Olympic Games. In 1991, when the USSR was dissolved, Moscow remained the capital of the Russian. Since then, a market economy has emerged in Moscow, producing an explosion of Western-style retailing, services, architecture, and lifestyles. Today, Moscow is governed as a federal city that serves as the political center of Russia. The city is one of the fastest-growing tourist destinations in the world, and is one of Europe's most visited cities. So guys what do you think about the future of Moscow? Comment down below, if you enjoy watching this video, Please don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you for watching.